Hi everyone, this is Love Crafty Girl. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing the weekly spread in my mini happy planner. For this week I chose a free printable by Victoria Thatcher and the printable that I chose is this one right here. I think it's super cute. It's all about sweets and strawberries and the little girl is so cute. I love the colors and I can't wait to go see what washi tape I'm gonna use for this spread. So continue watching and see how this spread comes out. So the first thing I'm going to do is place my bottom sticker and of course um, this layout is pretty much almost the same as before but I have to always make sure that I have a little white sticker to cover up this one area because the lines come through and if I don't do that it looks weird. Um, then I'm going to place my um, other stickers here on the next row, place another one in the middle. Then for washi tape I decided to go with this really thin one, it's really cute. It came with one of the cap, I think it was a cap. But I know it came up with one of the animal ones that I bought at Dice. So I know there's um these two washi tapes that came with a big one and a little one. So I'm using the little one that it came with. I thought it was kind of cute. It had like little pink flowers. I thought it was a cute one to go with this spread. Now for all the little boxes that this printable brings, I'm going to use them all for the column area. I think it's just easier that way um, than to spread them out into the white boxes. It's just a lot easier to have them all in one row and use it for that instead of putting them in the white boxes. And I think the reason I don't do it in the white boxes is because there's not enough and I end up always having maybe one or two boxes that are going to be empty and then I don't know how it's going to look good and plus it's not even. So it kind of bothers me not only knowing that there's something wrong with it but also just looking at it doesn't look good because when I always cut out my stickers I always make the layout on the pages moving things around seeing how I want to see the stickers laid out onto the page and then from there I move them to the side and then place them each to their area so now for the top top washi I decided to go with this pink um, polka dots but I wish I had gotten a lighter one I don't know for some reason I feel like it's a little too dark but it's okay I'm gonna still use it then I'm going to use a little piece of that small uh, washi right under that. From there, I will place my Days of the Week stickers and then I'll go off into the second page. Now, as I placed the bottom sticker on the second page, I realized I didn't trim the sides. Usually I do trim the sides before I place it down because it does cover the hole. Um, but in this case, I'm gonna leave it the way it's and I'll just make a little hole where the hole goes. Um, from here, I'm gonna go ahead and place my stickers and the washi tapes that I've done in the first page all the way to the top. And then from there, I will be done placing my stickers. So here's a file to put together the weekly spread. It came out really cute. I love this. Now for the top washi tip, I kind of regret going with the dark pink. I should have gone maybe for a lighter pink, but I don't know. I guess it's just going to have to go the way it is. Sometimes it happens to me where um, after I put do the layout, sometimes some, some washi tapes, I wish I had changed it to something else. Um, but you know what? It's okay. That's just how um, it is when it comes to doing a spread for your planner. At the end though, it still comes out really nice and it's still really cute to look at when you plan. So that's the most important thing. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.